Hello, it's Wednesday, March 28th, 2012 at 11.04 p.m. Central Standard Time. And I want to talk to you about this um, jet blue, blue pilot that flipped out um, while he was piloting an airplane. Um, I wanted to add my testimony to this because of an observation of something that's occurring in my life. Um, at about the two minute mark on this this particular um, video. I'll give you a link to it below the, the video that I make. He talks about, um, the man talks about the pilot had two bottles of water at the front of the plane and then he went to the back of the plane to get two more bottles. And something that's been happening to me is that I've had frequencies in my house and one of the one of the ways you can tell that they're ramping up the frequency is that it makes you really thirsty and actually thirsty is not the right word for it. It just gives you a really dry mouth and if it was thirst then when you drank water it would quench the thirst but it doesn't really quench. And so that makes me think that that what this man experienced may be a frequency problem. And to add to that if you go here, well let's see right here, and you look at this CNN um, report and I'll give you a link to that too. It says that it was at 10 a.m which is 16 UTC um, that it diverted to Amarillo, Texas so things were occurring right before that I assume and that it left New York at 728 a.m. so that was a couple hours earlier but if you go look at my video called Creating and Charging the Storm near Fort Stockton, Texas I'll show you that there's a um, couple satellite frequencies that show up one coming in this way and one coming in this way um, the first one being at 1345 UTC and the second one being at 1645 UTC which is right after they diverted the plane. But all in this area you'll, you'll see even though this is right, this is after it actually occurred, you'll see these things flashing on and off and I also see you also see a um, couple beams coming out of Amarillo. So there was frequency activity going on and the high degree of thirst is one of the signs and frequencies also can very much affect your mind because that is how our mind works is these little electromagnetic pulses that um, turn things on and off. So anyway I just wanted to add my two cents or whatever for whatever it's worth and um, maybe it will help someone but these things that are happening um, they're by design, they're not by chance, and things are being perfected in their usage, the electromagnetic, and in, in, in the electromagnetic realm. In a lot of my videos you can see weather manipulation um, using these frequencies, but also there's people manipulation going on, it appears, and it looks like it's ramping up. So anyway, there you have it. God bless you. I pray that he will open your mind to the truth and I pray that you will ask him to show you these things because it is the Holy Spirit that leads us into all truth and the darkness hates the light but it's best to know the truth because that's the only thing that's going to get us through the darkness. God bless you. Good night.